Hello guys, welcome back to another video and in this video we're gonna talk about how to fix apps are not working properly on realme narzo 15a and how you can fix this app so let's dive into it so the first thing what you have to do is you just have to check and make sure that the problem is not there due to the running the phone in the safe mode and then it will be you'll be having a trouble so which is very important and also you have to check if the app installed which is on the, this device is installed on the micro sd card and not in the phone's default memory then definitely you will be having the trouble also so you have to make sure that parts and which we have will be having both phone storage you will be having as well as if you, if you insert the microphone the sd card you will be definitely having that option so it is also very important so that's what it have to be make sure of it so also you have to make sure if a virus virus is there in the phone which can be directly cause the issue so then then the phone will not be working properly you'll be having a lot of trouble you'll be feeling like kind of laggy and you'll be having all of issues so you have to make sure when you are trying to download any files and you have to make sure that you have downloading from the good sites as well as you are trans the files in your mobile phones are correct i mean it's not malware or something so also you have to make sure that and also there are some chances that the phone features are manually turned off and the same thing is causing the problem for example imagine I have to say, suggest, I'm not saying it should be turned off, but also imagine there are a lot of things is running in the background and for a couple of days you're not clearing it, maybe a hard day, I have to say three to four days and definitely you'll be using the phone a lot, so there'll be def many things in the background, so definitely that will be causing you up, so that will be making you the issue up and this is what you have to take care of it and you definitely have to go for it and you have to fix the issue up and also one of the app related common problem which usually happens in Realme Narzo 15a is deny the necessary permission to the apps okay so as you can see that you have to go over here on the settings then you just have to go over here on the app management and we'll be having all the apps so you have to select the respective app and imagine these are the available apps over here and let me select the Amazon shopping and we have an option called permission right so if you're denying any kind of permission here then as soon as as you can see if you're not having any kind of trouble then definitely you'll be having the issues as well as I have to say when you're trying to open this it will not be opening up so you have to make sure that you have given the enough amount of permissions that is very important and also check if the apps are not up to date to the latest available version then you have to install which is also very quite simple you have to go for the play store for example I'm trying to log in with uh, I have to say I'm trying to log in for the whatsapp or I'm, I'm not saying login I'm going to use the whatsapp and it started working very randomly it started crashing then one of the solution is just have to go over here in the play store and you have to update it which is very important and also you have to check if the apps are not up to date to the latest version also as I mentioned this is also happening some in some cases and sometimes there is or this problem is experienced due to overheating of the devices as you can see I have connected here in the Wi-Fi and as I am using this uh, even for the video purpose I was completely checking out all the steps and I was practicing myself so I was using this from the morning till now and I haven't charged it up so it is connected to the Wi-Fi as well as I started playing some of the games even in between when I get bored so in all this scenario what happens is this card continuously using right when it started definitely it will be having some kind of overheating issues and so that is what we have to take care of it and we have to find a solution for that also so if you find the phone is overheating a little bit then definitely the solution is you just have to turn off the Wi-Fi you just have to clear all these things running in the background then throw it away and you just have to make sure that you have clear all these things that you just have to keep the phone for a few months let it cool it up and once it is done definitely you can use the phone this is what you have to do and also the reason you are facing the problem sometimes can be this or any kind of third-party apps that is very important so whenever you're trying to download something any kind of apps I suggest you have to use the Play Store you should not be using any kind of third party website or something definitely because there is going to be a lot of issue on your mobile phone definitely there will be a lot a lot of i have to say there will be a lot of you know malware and this will be causing the issue up and also that is very important and also you have to make sure you know uh, that your system is up to date i mean your phone is up to date and also check if you have changed any important setting of the particular app that's what i mentioned in the ear earlier like permissions some kind of things and if you made four stop then definitely you will be having the issue and this is very important and also you have to go for a reset your phone even if it's some cases and you can do this up so you can completely do a reset on a mobile phone and most will be this will be helping you out so you just have to go over here in the additional setting from here you just have to 
uh, you know you just have to go over here on the backup and reset and you have to tap on backup and restore option sorry uh, I mean uh, you have to tap on erase all data and these are the options like recent network setting reset system settings only you can go for all these things and you have to check whether there is any kind of difference in between or not and moving on to the next solution which I would like to make you notice is the last one is check the make sure the app which is causing the trouble then you just have to delete it and you have to try to install it back once again and see whether the issue is solved or even if you're any having any kind of trouble even after trying which I suggest the last one is all about you have to do a force I mean you just have to do a restart and see whether the issue is uh, I mean uh, fixed or not because you can do this very simply you have to press press and hold the power button over here for five seconds as you can see you'll be having the options to do this up so we are having the options and this is what you have to do and i hope this video is helpful and if you find this video helpful don't forget to subscribe and click on the bell icon for more notifications see you soon in the next video peace out